Ninja was with us last season, taking to the course on one leg. He is back. It is the incredible Mark Daniels. This is my second chance running the Ninja Warrior course. I feel last season I didn't reach my potential. I came off early. Bridge of Blitz, one, two, oh! So close. This year I'm coming back for Ninja Warrior, bigger and better. I've trained really hard for 12 months. I've achieved a lot of milestones, but physically it's taken its toll. Four months ago, um, training, I actually snapped my right femur. Uh, it was a pretty big setback. I was back in a wheelchair for about two months, but uh, I still trained. Um, as long as I was doing upper body and not lying on my legs, it was all right. It's been a lot of hard work to be able to get together. I'm hoping all that training tonight is really gonna make the difference. Here he is, Mark Daniels is back. Remember this guy in season two. Lost his leg in a motorbike accident, but he still comes here and tries to conquer the Ninja Warrior course. This lad is impressive. This lad has got guts. This lad's got determination. And hopefully, he'll go further tonight. He has been a very busy boy last year competing in the Invictus Games. Gold and a bronze. Gold in rugby and a bronze for four-minute indoor rowing. Imagine taking this on with just one leg. And can I remind everyone, it's a 1.7 metre leap. His one leg is doing the job of two. And not only does he have to push off on that leg, he also has to land on it. What about this bloke, Mark Daniels? Came in season two. Everyone is amazed at how he could do this. And he's amazing the crowd again. And I'm sure he's amazing you guys at home too. Just stop and take a moment and look at what oh. this guy is doing. Now the swing surfer. How is he possibly going to do this? We've already seen how difficult it is. It's going to be really tough. Go on, Mark. The swing surfer. Oh, he's on. Oh Mark Daniels goodness. has landed on the board. I don't mean to sound surprised, but honestly, I mean, how did he do that? He's hit the trampoline with one leg and managed to crash tackle his way onto that board. Off he goes. And now he's off. Yes. Come on, Marky boy. Oh. He's absolutely ripping and tearing at this Ninja Warrior course. And the crowd is on its feet, loving every moment of it. How on earth? Is he going to get through the tuning forks? Mama. Look what he's done there. The technique is one of necessity. This is the only way that he can do it, and it works. Come on, Mark. This is just such a nasty obstacle. Those forks move, and they're one metre apart. And this is all about creativity and flexibility and working within the parameters that he's got and he's used to doing that Mark Daniels go on, go on, go on. and he's on to the second four on, oh my son. goodness no one has completed the tuning forks tonight you're right Beck and Mark Daniels is now halfway through it if he gets through this the next obstacle is all upper body and we know that Mark will be able to fly through that one he's got a big leap here yes <laughs> he nails it this is unbelievable. What you are watching, what you are seeing, is strength, is guts and determination like you've never, ever seen before. He is a powerhouse. Look at him getting himself up. And he's done it! Take your hat off to Mark Daniels. We've just witnessed an amazing effort from Mark Daniels. And no matter where you're watching around Australia, I'm sure you'll agree, that is one of the best efforts we've seen this year on Australian Ninja Warrior. Absolutely. He is incredible.